The Tonga National Leadership Development Forum, or TNLDF, is made up of a group of eminent, influential leaders from various sectors of Tongan society. Based on evidence that a focused group of influential and willing leaders can affect significant change, the TNLDF was established as an experiment putting evidence to practice. Forum members recognize that leadership matters in charting the future of Tonga. As a respected cross-sectoral group, they are attempting to identify critical issues for Tongan society. Among the first undertakings of the TNLDF was the commissioning of a scoping study on leadership in Tonga to determine areas of need and gather recommendations for action. We ended up deciding a leadership code for Tonga would be something that uh, uh, would be very much needed. Members of the forum decided to take the leadership discussion to communities nationwide and embarked on consultations. The National Leadership Code is envisaged as an aspirational document reflecting the values of all levels of Tongan society with respect to leadership. Over the past year, community discussions on the National Leadership Code have spread to the outer islands and continue to create awareness around leadership at every societal level. However, the key learnings from the Leadership Code experience are not in the code itself but in the process of consultative discussion that it has uncovered. Through community consultations, Tongan citizens are charting their own cause to recognizing what leadership really means and holding their leaders and themselves accountable to practicing good leadership. At the request of communities through the leadership consultations, parliamentary representatives have been brought back to their constituencies, many for the first time since the elections. As a result, difficult but nevertheless important, conversations have been enabled as government representatives have willingly engaged in consultations stemming from their trust and respect for the TNLDF. It created a platform for elected members of parliament to define leadership together with members of their constituency, a key opportunity given the country's current political reforms. <laughs> In December 2011, the launching of the Vava'u Leadership Code marked a historic moment for the people of Tonga. The launching took place at Bowono, where in 1839 the Vava'u Code was introduced, forming the basis for what is now the Constitution of Tonga. So when we launched the Vava'u Code, uh, it was quite uh, very, very significant to have it at Bowono, right? because it's uh, uh, everybody linked it to the original uh, Vava'u Code. Leadership codes for Ewa and Hapai have also been launched with consultations around the Tokatapu Leadership Code currently underway. Once the island leadership codes have been completed, they will be incorporated into a national leadership code with plans to make a submission for cabinet endorsement. It is important to recognize the crucial role that the TNLDF plays in facilitating the consultations, clearly demonstrating the understanding of the culture and dynamics within the Tongan context. As citizens realize that leadership is exercised by more than just politicians or the heads of major organizations. As the initial convener of the TNLDF, PLP continues to learn from the experiences surrounding the Tonga National Leadership Code, from the consultation process and the valuable conversations emerging, as well as the changes in attitude being demonstrated. As in the case of the TNLDF, it does not necessarily take a large investment to mobilize people for positive change.